because um, my editor asked me to blog something from Make, and, and oh, okay. this looks like a really good thing. So, sure. so um, top of mind, we're building robot kits for kids. Mm -hmm. Kids built real robots by snapping the blocks together. They don't write code. They don't mm -hmm. wire electronics. They just snap the blocks together, and they build robots. The behavior of the robot is dependent on the way the blocks are put together. So by turning the blocks around, you get different robots. Cool. And children as young as three or four will play. Children as old as me will play. Cool. So can you show me what they do with them? Get one of these guys to do it since they're All right. Okay. So one of you should tell me how to do this. All right. So um, I think you've got the little introduction about yep. it's a robotic construction kit. Mm -hmm. There's different inputs and outputs. Any okay. black cube you see is an input. Mm -hmm. So this one can sense distance. The closer you are, the higher value it'll send out. Okay. This one senses brightness. The brighter it is, the higher the value. Mm -hmm. uh, we also have a knob. We have a temperature mm -hmm. uh, sensor somewhere. And then the clear box are action. They're the outputs. Okay. This one has a rotating face, uh, flashlight, bar graph. We've got wheels. So to make a Very simple cool. robot, you need three cubes. Mm -hmm. uh, you've got the power block, which mm -hmm. provides power to your robot. Mm -hmm. You've got an input. I've got a distance sensor here. Okay. And then output, a uh, drive cube. Nice. So you put those together, and the closer that you get to the distance sensor, mm -hmm. it'll send a higher value. Uh -huh. it'll send it down to the wheels, and so on this side, oh, as I you see. get closer, it'll start to run away from you. Neat. Um, so that's just the most simple robot you can build. Mm -hmm. Then you can uh, add complexity to it. You can add a flashlight to it. Mm -hmm. You can add a second uh, drive block, a second distance sensor. Mm -hmm. So here we have um, one that you can steer. You can, ah, if I'm close okay. to one side, that's right. going to activate that wheel more than the other one. Mm -hmm. Or uh, vice versa with the other side. So now I've got a robot that I can steer around the table um, from, that is seven cubes, and they're all very simple. Uh, they all have a very simple action. The distance sensor senses how close it is and now puts that value. The drive cube takes a value and it spins its wheel accordingly. Mm -hmm. Power gives the whole thing power. But mm -hmm. now we have a robot that has more complex behavior than just the simple components that okay. make it up. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.